Hey guys, it's me Troy Dellinger, and today I'm going to be talking about the re the rebuilding of the temple. And this is going to conclude my Bible history events on in the New Testament. And after this video, we are going to be moving on to the New Testament, and I am really excited about that because I love talking about that. I love talking about all of the Bible, but I especially am going to enjoy talking about uh, the life of Jesus because I believe that is uh, the most important part to start in the in the Bible. If you're a begin, if you're a new Bible beginner, or if you're an unbeliever, because uh, that that contains the heart of the gospel. <clears throat> And that contains everything that Jesus did for us, and it's very important to know for um, a person's salvation and a really good starting place for a Bible beginner. And this uh, Bible history is not only to educate about the Bible, but also for evangelistic purposes where we learn lessons about the Bible uh, to challenge us and so people can be saved. Because in the Bible it contains the gospel, and my goal of the of the playlist is to show how biblical history shows the gospel of Jesus Christ. <coughs> I apologize if you hear me coughing, and no, I do not have coronavirus. Uh, I have allergies really bad. <coughs> my eyes are getting watery, and uh, so if you hear me getting uh, coughing a little bit. Uh, I believe that it's just allergies. So, <clears throat> um, I will be giving a review of what I was talking about in my last video. In my last video, I was talking about the Babylonian captivity. <clears throat> so, after the Babylonian captivity, uh, they will be rebuilding the temple. <clears throat> and... Um, and, and it's mainly found in the book of Ezra and Nehemiah. And basically what they did was they uh, rebuilt the temple. And it was given permission from King Cyrus of Persia. Um, uh, Cyrus was from the nations, the outside nations, but he was uh, used by God uh, for a very specific purpose <clears throat> to bring the rebuilding of the temple. And the, and the Jews and the um, Judah, they had a lot of opposition from, from a lot of nations outside of the heathen nations to try to stop from building this temple, but they failed, and, they ended, and it ended up getting rebuilt. <clears throat> and this is about rededication, I believe. I believe the big emphasis on this is returning back to God and repentance and... Uh, <clears throat> uh, Judah and Israel were judged uh, severely by God for backsliding, for turning away from the Lord. Uh, but this is all about that rededication, returning back to the Lord in repentance. And they had a, uh, there was a big prayer found in these in these books and uh, very just beautiful scriptures that you know, talk about repentance and returning back to the Lord and <clears throat> and uh, and just. I love the book of Ezra and Nehemiah. Just, I would encourage anybody to uh, read that. <clears throat> and uh, and they were also rebuilding the walls of Jerusalem as well. So that's all I got. And thank you for watching.